appearance today. That's why I look like this and not Christmassy. Um, I wore this, I think, last in one of my other YouTube videos. But anyway, I think I'm going to wrap gifts a day early, so I want to worry about tomorrow. I have so much stuff to do before Christmas, and I haven't done most of it. So yeah, we're just going to do that. And I'm really excited for this week. It's kind of like a grand finale, but like not too grand. Chill finale, I don't know. It's kind of crazy to think about, but this is the last week of the wrapping gifts for the advent calendar for my boyfriend idea. Yeah, I kind of gave more than I thought I was going to, so it kind of ended early, but it works out, it's fine. But yeah, I'm really excited to do it. These gifts, I feel like, are the most manly, if you will, if that matters. <laughs> but I think they suit his taste, I guess. The first thing I got is really cute. I think the first thing I got was really cute. I think it was when Walmart first put out their Christmas stuff, and I was so excited to see these. I usually like their dishware anyway, or like drinkware, but how cute are these? I got in this little, you can hear them, this little green ornament shot glass. It's so cute. And he drinks Jaeger a lot, and it's about the color of a Jaeger bottle, so. That was cute. And these are like metal or really hard plastic lids and they're glass. So I thought they were super good quality. Can't remember how much these were for reference. Um, yeah, it doesn't tell. And I got two. This one I got for me. It's just kind of clear and pearlescent, I guess is what you would call it. But it's really cute. And found the receipt. How much do you think these were each? $1.98 plus tax. Such a good deal for glass and they're just nicely made and I like how they came with the little ribbon. Like you could hang these on the tree if you want like as an ornament and then be like oh surprise or put little shots in them of stuff and hang them on a tree for a party or something that'd be so cute but I don't know enough people have a party so I'm not doing that. Me and my boyfriend can just do that anyway but I didn't think of it sooner, so. But I have been waiting to give these to him. And I, these were one of the things I got first. Not how to just keep them. I thought maybe doing it the first week, but it didn't work out like that. So it's kind of good that they lasted this long because the other things and gifts kind of have to do with that. And then when I went back to Walmart another time, I can't remember if I was Christmas shopping. I probably was, or just shopping, I don't know. And I found the perfect gift bag to put it in and I wasn't planning on buying any more gift stuff like that to wrap stuff in. And it is so perfect. It's this Santa's Little Helper shot glass gift bag. And it's got this little note thing on it. I usually don't write on the actual gift bags because I like being able to reuse stuff and keep it. I don't know, I'm weird like that. Um, though I don't think I'll give this away or anything. If he wants it, he can have it, but he usually doesn't want stuff like that. And then the side is like that peppermint pattern, same as the front, and the back says it too. This wasn't very much, oh my god, this was 98 cents, the same price as the ornament hooks. But they were just doing it, going all out with the bags this year. Kind of wish they would have done more. I seen a little fishing one that I thought was cute, but like, I don't be fishing. <laughs> and I don't really know anyone that does like that, that I would be getting gifts for. But this is just so cute. And I found it kind of by mistake because I've seen other gift bags. They have this alien wrapping paper. And as you can tell, I think I like aliens. <laughs> and so I was really interested in that, but I got it like not even to use. Maybe I'll like laminate something with it and keep it so I can have it forever. But they had gift bags that I got not to give to anyone, just for me to have. Like maybe I can store stuff in it and use it as decor. Cause I do that in my closet. I use like cute gift bags to store like wigs and Halloween costumes and stuff. So that's kind of my plan, but I'll show you them. So another thing about me is I really like cryptozoology stuff. I really liked it. Even as a kid, I'd watch all the documentaries and be like, <laughs> shook over it. But they had this Bigfoot one and I thought it was so cute. It's not like a massive gift bag, but it's just kind of, I don't know, festive and cute. And another story, I think I might have shown this on TikTok and not on YouTube, but Walmart had these cat fleece-lined leggings where the cats were all tangled up in the cords and they looked really mad. 
and I thought it was cute, so I got those, and then when I wore those over to my boyfriend's to be like, oh, look at this cool thing I got, he was wearing like the Bigfoot ones, and I was like, dude, <laughs> you're copying me. <laughs> but anyway, that one's that one, obviously. I had to get this one, it wasn't like extremely cool, but it's an alien, a Santa Claus with the little peace signs, and he's kind of metallic. And it says, we come in peace and joy, or joy and peace, whatever. And I thought that was so cute. Like, no one's getting this. This is mine. They're both mine. So cute. I wish I would have done more. One year I seen alien Christmas card packs that were really cute, but they weren't Walmart, and I didn't get them because they were super expensive, but I would love to do an alien theme or something, or a cryptid theme. I don't know. The, the alien is also giving, like, Master Roshi a little bit, so... Kind of goes with my Dragon Ball Christmas theme this year. Don't even know. They're all aliens anyway. Like I said, my boyfriend usually gets like Jaeger. He's been getting like holiday alcohols lately, but I told him to get like vodka or something plain this weekend and I didn't say why, but these little rock and Santa like cocktail mixers. I thought were kind of cool. I remember these being around five bucks. I took the tag off right after I got them, so I don't know. So I like the little handle and it kind of looks like a guitar or something, but not, I don't know. These are all the flavors. Christmas Cosmo, Fala La Sangria, Spiked Apple Cider, and Peppermint Martini. And the bottles seem kind of big, but maybe we'll just like half these up with alcohol and put in the shot glasses is my idea. I don't know which one to give first, but I think I'm gonna give the ornaments first, that way he can use them or whatever, and then these, because I don't think it makes sense to do it, vice versa. And then, and then, and then, and then, um, and then, um, because he's a dude, he likes hot sauce, and I got these beer flavored ones I seen at another Walmart I went to. Um, I went there for the polyacrylic, and I was like, ooh, these are cool, <laughs> or maybe it's another time, I don't even know, but let's see these beer flavored hot sauces there's three of them do you remember how much these were oh that's kind of cool um <laughs> do you remember how much these were that they've got the little skulls on them oh my god is there a price remember these being five to ten bucks so like kind of affordable and they're decent sized so i don't know it's kind of like a novelty thing whatever and finally if you've seen in my first video he likes mew the pokemon mew I got this ancient Mew card. You can barely see it. There you go. And the sticker kind of covers it, but it's in a sleeve and I don't want to take it out. But I thought it'd just be cardboard or whatnot. It's metal. Literally metal. So hopefully he likes that. There's two other versions I was going to get for his birthday because it's in January, but I don't know. Depends like how he wants these or if he likes it because he has a few cards and not really something to display them in yet, so I don't know. But that's all of the gifts we'll be wrapping tonight for the final advent calendar part or whatever of his gifts. And I think it's a good finale. So I'm going to show you our options real quick because I'm not too sure about which wrapping paper to use on this. So we got and and not actually um, I don't know which wrapping paper should go with this bag because I think I'm just going to wrap these up in like a little sack thing and I don't know. I think it's between these two. I feel like because they're so much white, maybe I shouldn't do that and just use that. Think of this one. Think that one. So my heat came on, which is great because it makes it harder here, but I think I'm going to cut some type of square or maybe just a rectangle like this. I don't know exactly how long to make it and then we'll go from there so i've just placed these in what i consider to be at the center of it <laughs> and i guess we're just gonna like ball this up so i cut out the strip and i'm just gonna make it enough to wrap around it real quick that not look so weird <laughs> So I'm going to tape that real quick. I just made this little bow out of the scraps. It's not the greatest because it like fell on itself. 
Uh, I don't want to cover this part too much, so I think I'm going to put this to the side maybe. Hides that. I think that might be good enough because I angled it so it kind of fans out and this one sets back a little bit more than that one. So yeah, I think we're gonna, I think we're just gonna go with that. This next one, I think we're gonna go with this wrapping paper. So this is our little bow I've cut. I'm gonna tape it really quick. Looks so cute. My little hobo. <laughs> then these are the ribbons that I cut out to go with the end of the bow. Don't know exactly where I want the bow. Maybe like here instead of at the very top. And stick it down. Looks really cute with like not much effort, which is nice because you don't have to spend like a million hours on it and it all matches. So for the hot sauces here, I chose to use the little penguins again because I think they're so cute. And my favorite thing to wrap is boxes. I really like boxes. They're very satisfying to wrap. And I didn't have too many of them this year to wrap. I think it looks really cute. I don't know if it needs anything. I kind of want to put a bow on the top of it to hide that. But I don't know. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just leave it like that. I think I'll just leave it for once. We have a little ancient Mew card and I measured this and actually filmed it but my phone is being stupid so we're just going to tape that really quick. This is what it looks like. I kind of show the process but I just made that little ribbon real quick and yeah we'll make a bow. So our little bow is made and stuck on. It's so cute. I tried to make it more that way but it moved but whatever it's so cute. And that's all of the gifts. I want to include these really quick um, in this haul because I think I'm going to take them when I give the gifts and stuff and try them out. I was going to get two of each, but they only had like one or two of these. And I don't know, these are kind of expensive. They're almost $5 a can of pop because they're like Japanese, Japanese section, I guess, of the store I went to. But they had trunks too, I think. They didn't have anyone else. If they had Frieza or Beerus, I would have got them for my boyfriend, but I just got Goku. All they had was Goku Black, but peach flavor seems interesting. It's pretty cute. And then for a second I thought it was Pokemon, and then I looked again, and it was Digimon. If you remember the show, I watched it a little bit. It's pretty cute. And it's brown sugar, which is interesting to try. Kind of want to try that. They had another Digimon, but I can't remember the name of it. It was white and purple or something, but yeah, they were out of a lot of the drinks. Kind of excited to see if they get more in or something, because they used to just have simple Japanese drinks and not the ones with little art on them from anime and stuff, which is pretty cool. But yeah, I thought I'd include these real quick. The Dragon Ball one's my favorite though so far. They're both really cute. I'll probably keep the cans. I went to Big Lots yesterday and I seen this and I had to get it. It's really heavy. You can't really tell. <laughs> I wish you could feel this because it feels so heavy like the real thing, but it's hot sauces. It's almost like too good to use and open, but I thought he'd get a kick out of that. That's why I got it last minute yesterday. It was on sale too, which I didn't know, which was pretty cool. But this was really neat. I'm just going to throw it in this bag that I gave to him earlier in the season because I don't really know what else to put it in and I don't want to like wrap it because it's got all these components so I'm just going to do that and put like tissue paper or wrapping paper at the top to hide it I think. I had leftover wrapping paper from where we wrapped everything the other day so I stuffed that in there and put it around the sides and it should hide it all right. So this one's all ready to go. So they're all chilling right there. I think they look cute. I think it's a good end to the little idea I had, so yeah, thanks for watching, and hopefully I can get out my other Christmas stuff, but if not, this is the last Christmas video, maybe. Hopefully not, though, because that would suck, but yeah. <laughs>